Hey guys, what is up today? This is Dalsu, and Dalsu's playing more Darkest Dungeons, of course. The game that I love so much. Uh, <laughs> last episode, we wrecked. We literally wrecked the Wizened Hag. And uh, I, was, I was really scared going into it, and I don't know why, because we just decimated her, man. No losses, didn't even get us down to half health, really. Uh, it's been a while since I did a suicide run, so I'm thinking about that. Uh, I've just been studying this a little bit. Uh, the, the the missions have changed. We now have kind of, I mean, now that we're starting to get into the level 3 range with some of our champions or heroes or whatever you want to call them, uh, things are changing up a little bit as far as what we can choose to do. So we have another uh, mission here for uh, a boss fight. This is the Necromancer's Apprentice. But you see, I cannot bring Noanise on this mission because she's level 3. So she's effectively useless unless we decide to do a veteran quest which I really need everyone to be level 3 for. So, um, um, I'm a little bit of a loss for what to do exactly. Uh, I do want to get these guys up a little bit, but I also just want to keep turning out the suicide missions. I have the suicide squad here kind of ready to go. So, I'm having a little bit of trouble deciding exactly what I want to do. I think I need a bigger roster, really, so I can pick up more, more heroes. Can I do that? Is that something that's uh, possible here? Let's see. Um, yeah, I could make my roster bigger. But that's going to be all my scrolls. And if you remember, we need scrolls for, I think, the blacksmith. Is that right? Yeah, we want to be able to get even better weapons. Especially, so for level 2, technically we're entitled to a level 3 weapon, I think. Um, so we could do even more damage. But that's going to come at the cost of scrolls. I need 10 more scrolls to be able to get there and actually I need 36 more to be able to get everything that I want. So I may do like just a suicide run on the wield. We haven't uh, unlocked these. I'm not 100% sure if these are even done yet like as far as because the, the game's technically still in early access even though it totally feels like a complete game. Um, so I'm thinking maybe maybe to just do mission here to get scrolls with a kind of suicide squad now my suicide squad doesn't have a, a decent healer so I might send uh, one of my healers let's see Rachel we have Lisa and we have Sven Sven's level two so he could probably do a pretty good job but I'm, I'm a little apprehensive about sending one of my good characters on a suicide mission <laughs> because they're not gonna be as well stocked with stuff you know but I think that's kind of what I need to do. I can't really send a group out there without a healer and expect them to do anything. Also, I'm thinking about keeping Albert, Albert, uh, if we can, because we don't have a highwayman, highwayman, and highwaymen are pretty effective for, uh, especially for like shooting and stuff like that. See, he's got pistol shot, but he does not have grape shot blast. So I could give him. We got this last mission we got this gunslingers this is uh, plus 20 damage to range skills and plus 15 percent accuracy however it will hurt his uh, wicked slice so we'll pretty much be and it'll also hurt his bleed I guess so we'll pretty much be uh, stuck doing pistol shots but I don't think that's such a big deal like we can even put him back here and just have him only do pistol shots a pistol shot has a negative 25% damage mod, but, you know, and we have a, what? Negative 10 for what clerk? What quirk? Not clerk. Minus 10% accuracy. Minus 10% damage if HP is below 50. Well, his HP is not going to be below 50. Not for a while, anyway. Um, so, yeah, I think that'll be fine, him in the back there. And we'll put... I guess we want to put Rachel. Yeah, probably Rachel. She has an upgraded heal, doesn't she? She has a level 2 heal. Uh, she needs another level, though. So I guess that we'll put her on the Suicide Squad, even though it's a little bit dangerous. Uh, I'm not too worried about her dying. So we'll do that. And then we'll put some other guys. Like, I'll put a Leper. We, we could really use a Leper in our rotation. We have Vipont, who's a pretty decent, uh, pretty decent man-at-arms, really. And we should probably de-stress him. Griping in the guts could also be taken care of. Minus 20 heal skills while camping. That's not that big a deal. Mm. 
I don't know. I think we want to save our money. We're at 20 right now. Vampiric Spirits. That's not too bad. No one needs is fine. Although, it'd be nice if we could get rid of some of these. I think once they have the skull by them, they're like, you know, there forever. Okay, uh, so we'll bring... Panchardon. We got a bunch of French, French guys now. Uh, Alright. So I think we'll go here because we're trying to get scrolls, right? This is a short apprentice mission, exactly what we're looking for. Uh, low reward, but also low risk, and it, it comes with a few deeds which we desperately need, and a bounty hunter item which we have no use for whatsoever. Uh, so that's fine. We'll provision them kind of lightly. I will give them eight food and eight torches. And I'll give them a shovel, a key, some herbs, and a bandage. Okay, so that's kind of a not totally light, but light enough. And we'll go ahead. And do this. This is going to be mostly for the money. We're doing it mostly for the money. We're not in this uh, for anything else. We're probably going to throw away quite a few of these uh, characters. Corruption Just make so sure my uh, recording software is life. currently Make working. Rules. Yes, it is. Always got to check this. Now. Double check this with this game because if it's not working and I record a mission, you know, tough shit because it's not replayable, you know. All right, we're going to grab whatever's in there. Someone couldn't resist. Wow, that's shitty. All right, keep on trucking. It's a trap. 19 stress. Because he's level zero, he effectively has no stress resistance against stuff like this. And he's also blighted. That's unfortunate. As long as we don't lose our cleric. That's all that really matters. And we have two shovels now, so we'll grab... Okay, we got a thousand gold. Great. That was worth it. I would have preferred if those busts were uh, deeds instead, but oh well. Pop a torch, head in. Probably our first fight, I'm guessing. No? Okay, good. Uh, we'll go around like this. This is going to be a short mission. should be pretty easy, as long as these guys hang in there. Alright, looks like a pretty easy fight. These guys do have the uh, tendency to kind of reproduce, which is annoying. But besides that, it's all good. Critical heal, nice job. And why can you not pistol shot? Did I turn his pistol shot off? I did. But it's okay. I found out that you can actually turn it back on when you're not in combat. Which means we won't be able to use it right now. Which sucks. But I think if he moves up, he'll be able to do a wicked slice. Even though his, uh, he's going to have next, next to no damage. Alright, fine. Well, that was a little unprofessional of me. But, uh, oh well. Smack him. That was nice. Pretty good critical hit there. Perfectly executed. I don't know about perfectly, but executed anyway. Four damage, not a big deal. And choppy chop. Now, of course, he's, his accuracy sucks so bad. I always forget, but he really has garbage for accuracy. Alright, we should be able to finish it here, hopefully. Good job. Alright, it was an easy little fight. And we don't get anything for it, unfortunately. I will turn back on his pistol shot and move him to the back. That's where we're wanting him for this mission. Stashed heirlooms, please be deeds. All right, we finally got some deeds going here. We will hit another torch and head on in. Okay, these guys have protection and these guys do stress, so not, not a simple fight by any means. I wish she could do some damage somehow. She does not have the judgment skill. Which is kind of critical for a, a healer to have. Is anyone hurt at all? I thought, uh, oh, oh well, we'll just heal him. Maybe that'll help his stress. No, it didn't. Okay, pistol shot uh, on 5 to 10 damage, 82 to hit. Critical chance, 15%. That's pretty good. 7 damage, so two, 2 hits and he'll be dead. Uh, we're going to get a little stressed, no matter... He has very shitty resistance to stress, though. We'll do a hue. Man, this guy's chance to hit just sucks. His chance to hit is just makes him kind of meh, just such a meh character. I suppose we should give him one of those increased chance to hit modifying trinkets. Because otherwise, he's just useless. Uh, I think I'll activate Riposte. Hit this guy for zero damage and just absorb whatever they throw at me. 
confidence nice we actually crumbles. killed with a riposte that's nice I don't think he can do anything from back there though which is unfortunate and of course gonna grow up the lady stress the lady she's more resistant to stress than the other characters being a higher level uh, we can still do our pistol shot to and the damage kinda sucks I would have thought my damage would be a little bit better but I guess not at least she can smash but at this point she should probably heal she can't heal from where she is alright get a little damage on that guy that's fine um, yeah we can actually increase his accuracy or increase everyone's accuracy which is really nice that buff is uh, better than I thought now can you hew successfully please well that could have gone a lot better but okay Groping swipe. Okay, so the cleric's in a little bit of trouble, and she's the only one we don't want to lose, so we're going to have to do something about that. We're going to uh, have her dodge a little bit better. Or is that everyone's dodging a little bit better? Okay. Well, he actually does some pretty good buffs, I didn't realize. And this guy's going to get stressed out, but that's no big deal. Hopefully this will kill them. Yes, it will. But low damage, though. Uh, can we get a good pistol shot? I would have preferred a crit, but that's fine. Uh, she needs to heal, man. This does, uh, negative 20 damage. Okay. It doesn't do much damage, but... We can't even hit. Okay. We just crushed one of the corpses. Really? Ugh. That's super annoying. Six damage. He's really not doing much with that, uh... With that skill. Probably just have her eat some food so she doesn't. Nice dodge there. Alright, can you finish it off with a hue? Good job. Yeah, I think that Highwayman is uh, pretty clutch when it comes to the buffs. I didn't realize that those buffs were so helpful. So I think we're going to start using him a bit more uh, as a buffer. <laughs> Not as in like a buffer zone, but as in like someone who buffs. But can he do his buffs from there? He can, right? No, I mean, you. Yeah, you can do all that. From the front. I don't know, though, man. This this leper, his attack really sucks. I mean, like, it's it's enough to just not even work, not even have a leper, you know, to begin with. Because their attacks are such... I mean, he his accuracy is horrible. Oh, great. Now I'm blighted. Okay, fine. Why don't you just take the damn... Oh, we didn't bring an anti-venom. Alright, we got a shovel to deal with that. A victim to the spreading corruption. Okay, pretty nasty fight here. Uh, I'm gonna heal myself. Because I'm the only one that matters. <laughs> Blanket fire, miss. Dodge, miss. Nice, nice, nice. Okay. Please don't shank my healer. Why you gotta shank my healer? She's in a bad spot. Maybe she should go behind... Uh, behind him all right um you're gonna do shit damage anyway of course you do almost enough to kill but not quite so let's finish him off no we can't do that okay we'll hit him nine points is not bad we are going to be able to crush him and avoid an attack which is great. We we'll still get blanket fire from him. Only hit the first two. That's fine. She's bleeding one damage per round. Three rounds. That's not terrible. Give me a crush on this guy. Hopefully we can kill him before he acts. Not very nice there. Three damage to the healer. She's kind of getting in trouble. We'll probably just give her all the food. Finish that guy off. Great. Heal yourself since they keep targeting you and you're the only one that matters here and chop him great so now we gotta deal with all these damn corpses don't I have an ability that gets rid of corpses I think the leper does we can also shoot from the back which is pretty nice um, I think some lepers have it but he doesn't seem to actually have it Fine, we'll just hew the first corpses here, which probably won't... Well, I got rid of one, okay. That's not bad. 
Yeah, you got another chance to heal yourself, so why don't you take advantage of that? Six is good. You can roll with that. And looks like we can get the crush and finish it off. Okay. Not too bad here, not too bad with the fights. I do wish they would quit targeting my uh, my healer, obviously. I'm gonna move her to the back. Just so that she has a less less chance of getting hit. And popping a torch to keep us from getting stressed. Oh, I forgot that that was not actually in a room, was it? Okay. Go in here. It looks like there won't be a fight in here. If I'm not mistaken. Oh, yeah, there is a fight. Pretty bad one, actually. Man, why does this seem so much harder? <laughs> She's going to get the heal on herself, which is fine. And he's going to... He's going to hit probably, I guess, one of these in the back. Nine damage is cool. We can probably kill her with one more hit. Gonna go crazy, I guess. What's he gonna do? Masochistic. That's where you like to hurt people, right? That could be good. Find it as long as you don't pass. Fly. Don't do any passing, please. Um, smash him, yeah. Okay. Don't pull my cleric to the front, please. Good, good. Glad she resisted that. Gonna get groped again. Really, really handsy. Um, why don't we do the repost so that he can absorb some damage because I really don't want my healer getting hit nice counter there um, why don't you crush him see if you can start getting him damaged a little bit gonna stress out our highwaymen even a little bit more he may die from a heart attack before it's over with, which we don't care about. Uh, I'm going to heal this guy for a critical heal, which is nice. His repost has worn off, apparently. It only lasts one round, which is unfortunate. I mean, that kind of almost makes it not worth doing to me a little bit. Uh, Hugh would be nice if you could actually pull it off, which you did. Not, not bad. Okay. Props, props, dude. Um, let's hit him so that we might be able to avoid a, a damage. No, of course not. So he's gonna grope. That's fine. And an eldritch push on him is not such a big deal, especially if he resists it. And what are you gonna do? You're just gonna stress everyone out, aren't you? You big dick. Well, at least you did that. You redeemed yourself a little bit. Keep this guy at the front nice and healed up. And uh, could you actually hit this guy? That would be super nice. Good job. All right, we're doing fine. I'm going to... What am I going to do? Crush a corpse, I suppose. For only five damage and waste my turn totally. Uh, we can hit with a shot there. Man, that this guy, uh, I don't know. I don't know about that trinket on him. It's really not helping as much as I want it to. Critical hit. Well, myself, which is great. Um, can you crush? Nice. Alright, that worked out pretty well. Remind yourself Didn't that pay off very well, but it goddamn busts, man. I don't care about the busts. It's unlocked, so a key doesn't do anything, right? Uh, that's nice. Jade, okay. And, yeah, okay. Nice little payout there. That's what we're here for. And should we hit a torch? We're at dim light. Let's hit a torch and move on. We uh, we aren't that far from completing it. We're about halfway through right now. Go ahead and eat. Should we dig this up? Yeah, I guess so. All right. Nice. Four deeds. That's what daddy needs right there. Daddy needs a guild upgrade. No fight, fine by me. Keep on trucking. Uh, this is for the herbs, right? Yep. 12 food. I don't need 12 food. I guess we could just use some of it to heal up a little bit. Yeah, that's fine. Why don't you, why don't you eat one and... You eat one, and you eat one. We've got more food than we're going to need, for sure. Uh, pop a torch. Only one torch left. That's unfortunate. We're in dim lighting with only one torch left. But we're almost done with the mission. 
We'll go ahead and pop our last torch. The way is lit. It's gonna bring us the to a hundred. Clear. We require only the ah, damn it. it. We used our shovel. So we gotta go through it. Give, give us a little stress. Doesn't matter as long as our healer is okay. Uh, we're hungry again, really. Okay, fine. Torch is nice. Very nice right now. So there's definitely a fight in this last room because otherwise we'd have already completed the mission, right? So we'll prepare ourselves. We're at radiant light. We're at dim light now. Let's see. Those are not that hard. Especially, uh, well, it should be an easy fight. It should be a pretty easy fight. I think that they give blight. No, they give rabies, right? It's a good thing that he's going in the garbage can, because rabies is the son of a bitch, man. Uh, I'm trying to wait till they move so I can show you. Yeah, rabies is minus 10 accuracy. Oh, it actually gives you more damage. Well, his accuracy is such shit already that that's just... Uh, that's the worst thing we could have on him. Uh, of course you dodge. Critical hit. Reeling. About to break. This is fine. We're fine. Just need to get some damage. And I know you're not going to be the one to do it. You're about to miss, aren't you? 37% chance, chance to hit. Oh, that is just garbage. Um, give yourself some protection so you can just tank for us, please. Because you're pretty much worthless in terms of hitting people. Five damage is shit. So, we're not really doing very well in this fight here. For the slightest lapse it's kind of lucky that it's the last fight. Did he get rabies too? How quickly the tide turns. Yeah, we need to start doing some damage here. Or this could actually be trouble. He got rabies too. Great. So we basically just can't hit anybody anytime. Uh, can we pistol shot him and kill him please? Thank you, finally. Looks like my highwayman's the only guy who's going to do anything. Four damage per round. Alright, you need to... That's not what I meant to do, but that's fine. Does it give a double buff? Yeah, it does. Okay. Um, yeah, you need to be healed because you're, you're going to bleed out. Not that it really matters. All you're doing is just taking, taking hits. Uh, okay, can we actually kill someone, please? That would be great. Of course not. So, we're in trouble here because <laughs> we just, we can't get any damage done because they have rabies and they're already shit. Meanwhile, we're taking damage from, from all these, all this bleeding. I'm gonna keep healing this guy, even though I really don't care if he dies. Uh, I, I was hoping they would kind of hit him. I probably should repost. Repose, re, whatever you, whatever you say. Um, I guess this would give us bleed resist. It's not even worth it trying to hit people with him because it's like such a low chance. Uh, what are you gonna do? You're gonna stress everyone out, of course. But then, could you actually hit someone? That would be fantastic. Thank you. That makes a big difference. Um, could you actually hit someone? Good job. All right, it looks like we'll be fine. I would prefer it if my healer didn't have so much stress. That's going to uh, take away from our profit, as we're got, we are going to keep her for sure. Otherwise, everybody else is going in the garbage, so it doesn't matter. Uh, Wicked Slice, I know your melee damage is shit. I guess you can try a chop. 37% is not enough to make it even worthwhile, but... Whatevs, dude. Finish it off. Finish the mission. Nice suicide run. No suicide. <laughs> uh, so I think we just made a couple. We basically made a couple grand if you count everything. Which is, you know, eh. I mean, it's worth doing. You don't lose anything. You just, all you do is, so it cost us maybe two grand to run the mission. Maybe three grand if you count de-stressing our cleric. So, um, we basically made four grand, but more importantly, we got ten, uh, ten deeds. And deeds are like what we're sorely missing here, so 
Yeah, I don't really care about these. All I care about is her. She is less stress resist if her HP is down. Lethargy sucks. We're probably gonna want to heal that. Yeah, I don't care about this guy. I remember days when the sun shone. So we're back to 25 grand, which is nice, of course. It sucks because we have to stick Rachel. She, she's fine anywhere, huh? Okay. We're gonna have to stick her somewhere. I was gonna stick her in the damn tavern. Of course, he's there. So we'll do the Abbey. Yeah, the cloister's super leveled up. So you just go into the cloister, get yourself fixed up, and we will save the rest of the decisions for later. Although I will just fire these guys quickly. Dismiss him. I thought about keeping him, but I'm not gonna do that. Uh, I guess we should keep the uh, <laughs> keep the trinket just in case. Not because I'll actually use it, just because I feel stupid if I throw it away. Without the stomach for this place, uh, no you're problem. fired to you, stupid. Nope. I don't want to rename you. I don't care what your name is. Just get out of my office. Sorry, dude. And you too. I like your name and all, but. You're really useless. Um, just glance real quickly. There's another jester. Nah, we probably won't hire any of these people. We do have three spots though, so... Might as well just grab them, and then when we get ready to do a new suicide run, we can either we can either keep them for the suicide run, or... have them do something else. Replace them, in other words. Uh, and we'll grab this guy, I guess. Okay, so that's our Suicide Squad for the second mission. Um, I feel like Vipont should probably get some stress relief as well. And yeah, I think I'll probably use my scrolls to upgrade, but I'll wait. Look, we're low on paintings now too. Portraits. But we'll wait. We'll wait until the next episode to make all those decisions. I like to make those fresh, like right before uh, we get started. So thank you for watching. This has been Dalsu for Dalsu Plays, and I hope I will see you next time when we'll do uh, an actual mission with some, <laughs> some of our A-team. See you for that. Bye.